Jeez. You suck, man. Well, it's been a while, I guess. Let's play some Isaac. I mean, it ain't a bad game to play. What do I need to do? Who needs to do what? I've completed a lot of shit with a lot of the characters. Huh. That's odd. I guess I need to play a Samson. It looks like I haven't done... What is the little thing in the bottom left? Is that the blue baby? Have I not killed or Azazel or Lazarus? Damn. I ain't done nothing with nobody. Son, I don't remember the last... Well, the last run I did was with Garrett. So... So, right off the bat, item room, best item in the game. Tears up plus knockback shots. Well, son, let's see how these work out. <sighs> trap rooms. Can't knock back traps. Hey, spider. Look at this knockback, son. I kite spiders all day, every day, babe. Red poop on the first floor. The hell is this? What the hell is this? Hey, Monstro, how you doing? Monstro, are you listening? Um, I probably should have taken some intentional damage since it's the first floor. And you can't get a deal with the devil on the first floor. And Samson's a bloody tear now is cumulative damage over a floor. This made fattest pro level Isaac strats. It's like almost like I understand what the hell I'm doing. I think there's been like a big patch since the last time I played this. I think they nerfed everything good about the game, which was Krampus's head. From what I understand, it's a six item charge now. Which means it's worthless. Nah, it's secret. It's spoiler. It's still probably one of the best items in the game. I mean, I'm not one to decree an item the best item in the game on the, you know, no evidence whatsoever, but it ain't a bad item. This damn it might be good, I suppose. Come on, be good to me. No spoon. Oh, the belt. That's the same thing as the spoon. <sighs> now Samson's going to be the main character in Kingdom Hearts because he's got all these belts. That's the joke. Slot machine! Put my one penny in there, son. Fine. I didn't want items anyway. Items are done. <laughs> Real players play purist. Oh my god! Spiders! I can't believe I let a spider hit me. That's it. No more deal with the devil. He's just watching and shaking his head and sighing dejectedly. He's so disappointed in me taking red heart damage, he's not even going to do his normal Al Pacino voice. What a shame. Um, uh, why do I want to be in that room? A good item to be in that room other than Epic Fetus would be Polyphemus Quad Shot. <sighs> the Magnet. Magneto. <sighs> Peel's here. I could try to get to him, but I know I would fuck it up, so I'm not going to. Maybe after we beat the boss, if there's a bunch of red hearts laying in the room, I'll go back and try them out. The damn widow. Well, uh, I did get hit once, so the only benefit to that is that I do slightly more damage now. Got hit twice because spiders are bullshit enemies. And then you, you give them patch game once you take the spiders out. <laughs> uh, the most enjoyable part of an Isaac run is complaining about is nitpicking and, and having petty complaints. It's what the spirit of Isaac's all about. Well, I can shoot more. That heart is coming at me. I was like, alright, let's try to get one of these peels here. Grab and peel. Whoop. There it is. Alright, and whoop. Ugh. Bad gas. That was worth it. Now let's just rush forward. It's the Samson style. He is the berserker of the game. His love for you is indeed like a truck. Um. Oh, God. Alright. Well, damn, I shoot the most fucking tears. What am I saying? Oh, by the way, there's the seed if you want to do this shitty run yourself. Play Isaac amongst yourselves. All right. Hey, Boney. I hate. Oh, how I hate. <laughs> okay. Fucking hate. I do hate those skeletons, though. I also hate these spiders. I hope I die soon so I can restart. <laughs> now I'm cursed to live forever. Samson runs are still a pain in the ass. Like, he's not as bad as he was in vanilla. Enemies that are turrets that walk towards you also bullshit. Basically, every enemy in this game, except maybe the little poops. The little poops are the only acceptable enemy. Every other enemy is bullshit. Well, what do you fucking want? What makes you pop up? Is it when my blood pressure spikes? Because damn if it isn't. If the item... Okay, I'm not ready to fight boss. If the item on this floor isn't good, then the run's over. It's, and the, the Tenfei channel is over. And love is over. 
Hold on. I want to lay a bomb right there. I want to blow up all the mushrooms. Fine. Don't give me any peels. You ever had a really bad Isaac run? It's just, the thing about this game is, like, you just, you have to get, you either have to start as a Zazazel, as a Zazel, or you just have to get really good items on your first couple of floors. Otherwise, it becomes a tedious fucking mess of a game. It's, uh, it's not balanced very well. You hear that, Edward Cullen? Are you listening? I hope you are. I hope you were listening, you were drinking a Capri Sun, and when I said that, it shocked you so badly to your core that you accidentally squeezed the Capri Sun really hard, and then it all just shot everywhere, like a vitamin C bukkake all over your face. Alright. Bad gas, the only peel in the game, by the way. They patched all other peels out, they decided they were too powerful. Oh, oh, thank God. I'm the guy trapped in the vat of oil in water world watching the torch fall and oh thank god all right let's see if maybe the game decides we're allowed to have items that you know benefit your character this run that would be wouldn't that be a nice change for kids you are taking it entirely too fucking long i don't have the patience for this shit uh, i think this series if i continue it is just going to become all azazel all the time because then it doesn't matter what items you get well, that's not true. You might get, like, Bob's Rotten Brain and then you're fucked. But still, regardless. Alright. Hey, little poops! Well, once again, the only acceptable enemy. They're so happy. Alright. There's the boss. Who's the boss? There's the boss. If we find the cursed room, I'm gonna run in it just to take some damage. And make myself a little bit stronger to kill the boss faster. It's a good strategy, I prove Kind of like how when you play as Eve, you have to immediately take a heart of damage so you can be Horror Babylon. Because why even bother otherwise? Alright, come on. Come on, man. <sighs> uh, I could restart a floor. Isn't that lovely? You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to kill the boss, get an item, and I'm going to restart this fucking floor. Pin! Oh! Oh! He's not even that bad of boss. Once I build up petty complaint momentum, though, it's hard for me to stop. Anyway, what was I saying? Something about this being game of the year, all years, the best game of all time. No bad items. Name five bad items in my Isaac Rebirth. You can't do it. I honestly don't care that he's hitting me. <laughs> On the first floor, son, damage ain't nothing. Unless, you know, you're playing as a character with, like, one or zero HP. Then I guess damage might have a little bit of impact, you know. Might be something to, to keep in the back, back burner of your mind there. Keeping the, the crisper drawer of your mind. That's kind of the opposite of what I said in it. Old bandage, HP up. Alright, forget me now. <laughs> the game's like, what? Okay. Do I get to keep my items? I do. There's the, yeah, the, the seed. The world seed. Is that fucking soy milk? Well, I guess if you're going to get... Damn, look at my <laughs> attack speed. If you're going to get soy milk, you got to get it right at the beginning of the game. Because then you can hopefully build on it. Because it starts out shitty. But it has the potential to be the best item in the game. I can't even kill one fucking little spider with it before he hits me. Oh my god. Edward Cullen is just laughing. and He's, he's hanging out with Hideo Kojima and Shigeru Miyamoto. They're all video game developers that love to torment me, and they're just sitting in a room and laughing right now. They're watching this in real time as I'm recording it, somehow. Alright. It's so pathetic. Look at this! The little... I just realized I have Curse of the Unknown. I was like, why do I have a health cage? But it's just so pathetic that the tiniest little baby spiders, are, I can't out deeps them. In a deep race, I lose. Alright, let's see if I can at least kill the boss. The Widow! Oh no, he has little spiders with him. That means I'm ruined. Alright. Look at the damage, or the lack thereof. We need we need a lot of damage up to this motherfucker. How does this shit sync with Polyphemus, by the way? Does it? All I know is if you get this power up with Brimstone, you're fucked. 
because your brimstone charges in half a second, but it does a nat far to damage, so you just have to like flick the shit out of the controller. Well, we killed that motherfucker. Now just 45 minutes of fighting these things. You turn into like, it turns into Smash TV when you get this shit. Except in Smash TV, I think your attacks actually deal damage. You try to fucking die. Seriously. You're, you're literally killing me. I'm gonna have most damn HP if I ever manage to get a deal with the devil. I wonder if this shit syncs up with like mom's knife or something. Something weird like that. Oh! Alright. Here we go. Fatty fatty. Two by four. Oh god, you have so much HP. If they would... If I if they didn't move, if they stood perfectly still, well, we can freeze time. I guess we're gonna need it to be able to hit the enemies enough with this fucking thing. It's the fucking Isaac Head Blob Monster. I'm sure the damn thing has a name, and I'm certain that I don't know it. Of that, you can be assured. All right, hey guys. But anyway, are we having fun again? It's fun. It ain't a bad idea to run, I suppose. It'd be, it'd be good. Have I said that phrase enough today? Accidentally got the secret room. Oh, that was worth it. Worth it. All right. Hey, guys. <laughs> it's something about how many shots this takes to kill an enemy. It's reminding me of something, but I can't quite place my finger on it. Some shooter. It's like It's like... This item turns the game into a bullet hell shooter, and every normal mob in the game is a boss. Hey, Dingle. Guess what? You sat right there. I'm gonna put deeps in you. Oh, I guess it doesn't completely freeze the boss. Or I guess it doesn't freeze enemies at all. It just slows time down. I do like that it fucks up his distance of his little fart slide, or whatever the hell you would call that move. I just... Oh, I stood there and let him hit me. And I enjoyed every second of it. That's the worst part. Look at that damage meter ever so slightly decrease. <laughs> oh, God. This has been a bad run. This is a bad session. Why do I still record this shit and put it on YouTube? Oh, thank God. The latch key. It's... I have to get something that lets me do damage. <laughs> God damn it. I hate bonies. Do, 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 do. That's how bad we've gotten. Is I'm singing. I'm singing covers of I Want Candy. Okay. We're going to get to the item room on this floor. I might die, but we're going to try to get to the item room on this floor. And if it isn't something that turns this run upside down then we're not continuing on because I will not sit here and fuck first of all torment myself and worst of all torment you the viewer with having to watch me take 65 minutes to clear a room of three flies I guess I could look in here yeah I'll open them real soon that'll be worth so much what two troll bombs some spiders and guppy's tail alright they Take so many hits. Have you caught on to that fact yet, kids? That room is pointless. Alright. What would soy milk benefit from? Uh, well, other than damage increases. Maybe poison damage? Probably not even that. How does this shit affect, like, technology? Alright, let's see what we got in here. Uh, headless baby. Yeah, funny thing about that. All right. <laughs> God damn it. Yes, curse room. Hurt me more, snake. Yeah, there we go. That's just about what I thought I would get if I went into that red chest room earlier. Hey, the broken onk just kind of showing up in a room for fun. Ah, uh, bitty mush. Ain't it, it ain't a bad item. Not exactly what you want to get as your very first item in the game, but... Well, I guess technically the Broken Aunt was my first item, but I meant my first item room item. You knew what I meant. Stop trying to, to nickel and dime me to death. You ain't Atticus Finch. Stop trying to turn my words against me. I've never seen or read To Kill a Mockingbird, so I don't know if that's something Atticus Finch does. I've watched How to Kill a Mockingbird, probably the greatest Flash animation ever made. You should go watch that instead of this. I'm just dying. It's, you'd almost think I don't 
you know, I'm not giving it my all, and I don't particularly care if I complete this shitty Samson run. Wouldn't that be a tragedy, kids? How would you sleep at night if I didn't get to the end of this shitty, fucking useless Samson run? All right, who have I got to kill? You? Hey. Oh, what a fucking shit. I actually didn't intend to die there. I got resurrected as the blue baby. Well, I gotta keep going now. Um, which means even if I do get to the end of the game, it's not gonna count as a Samson clear, I don't think. I'm pretty sure once you change characters via an item like that. Also, my damage is in the fucking corner right now. I guess because I died so much. Alright, well this... Yeah, I'm, I'm just the blue baby now. You can't escape him. The blue baby is love and the blue baby is life. Yeah, fuck you. Fuck you, treasure chest. With a bunch of shit around you. Why is red poop appearing so early in the game? I don't... Is that something they patched in? Because Edward Cullen hates people and their happiness. Why did I hit that? I'm so... Disgusted right now. An item... Literally, and for... For a very rare instance, I'm using the word literally correctly. Literally useless for the blue baby. The yum heart. From Parker Brothers. I guess I'll use a bomb to get two bomb. Man, the honeymoon period on this game is going away quickly for me. When this game first came out, I immediately played like 60 hours of it and loved it. But now all of a sudden, it's a, every game is a goddamn train wreck. Maybe I should just play as Azazel. Z -Z 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 Maybe I should play as Quasicoddle. Alright. Just one damage increasing item. See, the thing is, Edward Cullen put all this shit into the game that makes it whimsical and fun. But it's all useless unless, you know, you can get the ability to actually kill enemies. Like... Clown shoes are funny, but if you're like a Scottish uh, knight, I don't know why I went with Scottish, like, they don't help you. You need boots with spikes on them so you can kick people to death. I have a really weird concept of the Scotland and its knights. Are Scottish knight shoes like the more, the more rugged, rustic version of British knight shoes? Do they still make British knight shoes? Alright, what's this peel do? Uh, <laughs> I can use my yum heart more. Yum heart! Oh my god. I guess I'll leave his batteries in case I do find an item. However fucking unlikely that is. Alright, come. <sighs> yes, let's drag it out. Let's drag it out as long as we can, kids. Maybe my torment will never end. Hey, Monstro. I'm gonna... I need to hit him with this thing, because it'll damage him faster. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna die. Okay, let's kill Monstro. Yay us. We win. Oh, no. Deal with the devil. What you got for me, sweetheart? Guppy's hairball. That's my item. Isn't that lovely? You know what? Why don't you just keep that? Why don't you just hang on to that? That broken fucking shit. I'd hate to make the game too fucking easy. Hey, Rainbow Poop. The kids love it. Kids love Rainbow Poop. Alright. This is a... I don't know. This is somehow worse than when I had the fucking soy milk. Oh my god, everything takes forever. We're all growing older and dying more and more with each passing second. And yet I'm spending it in a room in a video game that I'm not particularly enjoying. Shooting enemies for 45 fucking minutes. Alright, oh my yum heart's done charging, there we go. That'll put me right back on track. Thanks for opening the secret room, guys. You're awesome. 
Thanks for opening the left door, guys. You're awesome. Wow, an uh, actual item drop that I can pick up and use. What's in here? Loads of money. Okay, that... I don't have any fucking keys. Oh, I can bomb my way in there. Good. <sighs> so dejected. My two current, quote unquote, current runs on my channel are Binding the Tenfei, Rebirth, and Dark Souls 2 Deprived. And they're both horrible and depressing. What the hell? Why can't I bomb my way into the item room? That's really odd. Is that something they changed? There's a counterfeit penny. Oh, fuck you. I'm gonna be broken out forever. Um, yeah, that's, uh, that's odd that I can't bomb from the secret room into the item room. You've always been able to do that before. What could have changed? Were people having too much fun bombing their way into the item room? Said so we're calling and put a stop to it. Hey, well, I got loads of money. Let's see if I can get a key out of this asshole. I guess I could just give him every cocksucking cent I have. Mom's coin purse. Let's see what we got. Balls of steel? Ball well shit. I was just kidding, but damn. Tears down, thank you. Pretty fly, well thank you. Alright. I sh it I'm glad I got an item that makes it take longer to kill enemies. I was getting this breakneck, this breakneck speed I was going at was a bit much, wouldn't you say? All right, all right, come on, guys, seriously, I ain't, I ain't got all fucking day for this shit. Okay, I'm just, I don't, I don't have any fucking keys. I need one. I can't get into the shop. I can't get into here. Let's just kill guardian flies. Out of spite. Alright. There. I don't feel any better. Can't bomb through the secret room. I could bomb into the cursed room, but... Yes, fine. Or right, let's see if we can bomb into the cursed room. No. So, what the fuck? That, if that's a genuine change that Edward Cullen made to the game, then fuck Edward Cullen. Okay. I'm sorry people were having fun playing your video game, but there's no reason to take shit out of it. Alright, we gotta blow that chest. Oh, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. Alright, what's in this? One key. No! Child's heart! Another useless fucking item for this run. Oh, don't forget to eat your yum heart, kids. Alright. You know what? Fuck it. Let's just go in the grocery room. What do I fucking care? Oh, hey. A bunch of enemies and I can't leave. This, this is good. This is good. I'm glad we came in here. I'm glad this happened. Hey! At least this increased... Oh, Edward Cullen, you certified asshole. This is this shit has got to be intentional. There's random, and then there's you know correlation. Well, the guillotine, an item I absolutely fucking despise. I don't know if I've ever gotten it during a run for my shitty YouTube channel, but now my head rotates around my body, which makes it nearly fucking impossible to aim my attacks because I don't know. I had to concentrate on where my body is standing, but also aim my head at the enemies. I probably shouldn't have picked it up, but after all the shit I went through to get a key, I wasn't going to not pick it up. Hey, look, we're getting a bandage girl familiar. Yay, us. Yay us! Okay. I can't believe we're still alive. Well, there's another item room that I might... See? I can't fucking tell where my... Because your body takes damage. Your head shoots, but only your body takes damage. But you can't... The human mind wasn't designed to multitask in this manner. 
Okay, I can't know what two different celestial bodies are doing at what. Oh, well, here we go. Game changer right here, folks. Dead bird! Oh, my goodness. You're, you're spoiling us. I didn't mean to be standing there when that blew up. I'm I'm getting you know I'm getting genuinely upset like not even comically upset I'm getting salty right now with this shitty fucking series of Isaac runs they're so god awful you know what I'm gonna just lay down an ultimatum for people playing Isaac when you play this game if your very first item on the first floor isn't a good item then just restart Okay, you're not gonna have a fun, goofy adventure going through the floors. You're gonna have a tedious fucking mess. You're gonna waste precious minutes of your life that you'll never get back with this stupid bullshit. I'm only doing it because I, I'm trying to entertain people on the internet. You can see how well that fucking goes. Just look at the view count on my fucking video. Yes, nuns have it. I gotta make sure my yum heart charges faster. Here, just we need to donate as much money as we can. If I knew where my fucking body was, maybe I can put all this money into this machine before I die. And there you go, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Ace of Bases is gonna show up any second now to start singing. It's a beautiful life. That's how fucking beautiful this is. Okay. More of these motherfuckers. Hey, my damage is pretty high. I've been getting the shit knocked out of me this whole floor. Oh, great. These things. Just gotta wait a good 65 or 70 minutes and they might actually pop their heads up and then I can shoot them. If I can line my fucking decapitated floating head up with their trajectory. Good times are being had right now. We're having a good time, kids. Don't let anything fool you. Don't let anyone fool you. Oh, damn. I died. What do we do? Do we go? Yes, we're gonna go. We're gonna use the, the rule I just laid down. Walk in here, open that. It's spiders. Oh no. Walk out. Okay, now our damage is slightly increased. It's time for pro level Samson play. Son, you gotta know when to hold him down and And of course, I can't get into my item room until I fight off a fucking scene from the mummy. You know, where a bunch of insects attack. That, that happens in the mummy, right? I think there's scarab beetles in the mummy. That like crawl inside your skin. Sorry, creepy. Petrified poop. Sometimes I like to read item names very boisterously. It's the only thing keeping me going. Thank you for the key. Okay, what we got? That is best bud sworn protector. What does he do? If you get hit, does he appear and attack enemies? If it was attack fly, okay. So you do you appear? When I get hit, here, let's see, and you fight the enemies in the room. Is that what you do? No, you just kind of, I mean, he's doing damage. Damn, my damage must be in the corner. I just realized I'm at half a heart. Okay, let's see. Let's see here. Luckily, I don't need him right now. That's what we're going to have to do with Samson is find a room with like three hearts in it at the beginning of every floor and then just get the shit knocked out of us. And Samson's like Lucario, if I wanted to compare it to Smash Brothers, because the kids like Smash Brothers, right? I need a smart bomb to eat. That's how you make Lucario strong. Okay. Let's just use the cube of meat to kill our enemies. There we go. There we go. There we go. There we go, lads. The problem is, I don't want to get the shit knocked out of me because, you know, deal with the devil. Ooh, ah, Al Pacino. But... Considering the only deal with the devil we've gotten this whole session was for Guppy's fucking hairball. I don't know if I can trust him. It, what does the world come to when you can't even trust the devil? Beelzebub himself. The greatest trick the devil ever pulled was giving you shitty items and buying Isaac. Are there? There's no enemies in this room. Okay. Okay, what have we got? You give me poop bombs. Poop bombs! I'm gonna get those pills. Well, 
I found Beals. Full health! Well, that would have been... Well, if I find one of those later, I can use it in my Samson strategy I came up with earlier. My half-assed cart before the horse Samson strategy of intentionally getting the shit knocked out of me. So that I could do damage later. It's an investment. Samson is a, he's like the IPA character. IPA? I don't know anything about finance and investing, so you had to forgive me on that front. Okay. I don't think I've gotten hit yet this floor. You could tell because my damage is pitiful, but just, you know, deal with the devil. Normally I would do a bad Northern Line impression here about getting a deal with the devil, but I uh, can't. By the way, I probably should have prefaced this video. Um, I have a cold right now. It probably is contributing to my lack of energy and also just general not giving a shit attitude. <laughs> I probably shouldn't be recording this right now, but it's been like three days since the video went up my channel. I figured y'all fucking deserve something, even if it's this fucking train wreck. There we go. I got nicked by him though, so yeah, the devil's gone. There was a devil. He's gone now. Alright, we got the halo, so at least we'll do a little bit more damage. Right? I don't know if I showed you the seed yet. There it is. If you're... Don't do any of these fucking seeds. Alright. I miss the, the fat fly. Remember that run where I had that big chubby fat fly with me? That was the best Isaac run ever. Those were the Halcyon or Halicon or Halibut days of my Isaac youth. And I'll never get them back. Okay. Hey, guys. Okay, I feel like I'm actually hurting enemies now that have this halo. It might be the placebo. The halo see low effect. It's, placebo and halo are surprisingly hard words to combine. Even though they end in the same vowel sound. <sighs> we got curse of the... To get teleported around a room, don't we? Alright. What do you think? Cuban meet these guys? You... These guys fucking rinkied together and pulled some Chrono Trigger dual tech bullshit where the poop monster ran into the fucking globulin and knocked him into me. Like I'm Tagoro hiding my power level and they're Yusuke and Kubar. It's If you haven't watched Yu Yu Hakusho, then don't worry about it. It's not worth researching to get that shitty joke. It wasn't even a joke, it was a reference, which is why all my quote unquote jokes are. Well, I've been getting the shit knocked out of me, so there's no reason to even, you know, fuck try to not take any damage anymore. What you got for me, the game kid? That's actually a hand about him. Not gonna lie. A little invincibility, a little damage to enemies, getting some hearts back. It's like my little unicorn, but better. Okay. Hey, you two. Seriously, I don't know the trick. I know if you shoot them constantly, they won't pop up. But I don't know the, how to make them pop up faster, other than to bitch and moan into a microphone. Maybe that's the secret. Someday. Someday I'll live in a world where these two enemies are dead. But I may never make it. Alright, we might as well look inside the shop. What you got for me, sweetheart? The map. It is a nice item. If we find three more scent, we'll come back and grab that map. Alrighty, alrighty, alrighty. What's all this then? I'm saving the game kit for the boss, by the way, in case you can't tell. Alright. Because, I mean, there's no way we're getting to deal with the devil chance, so. Peep! Here, I'm the game kid. Oh, just jump in the air for 45 minutes while I'm invincible with the game kid. That's, uh, that's, that's good. Alright. Well, my attack flies up. He's not the guy to attack fly, that's for sure. He just kind of flies around like an idiot. What you got for me? Ah, eh, torn photo. I'm not going to complain. Surprisingly, you're like, what? <laughs> it's all you've done. All right. I just blow this shit up. There we go. Loads of money. There we go. And put two cent back in here to grow one. Getting teleported all around. Okay. Just walk through the same room twice. Okay, this floor is where everything changes. Hashtag game changer is this floor. What's all around me? The boss. Maybe down. Alright. Oh, God. 
Not a big fan of Wall Spider. I mean, I'm not one to complain about an Isaac enemy. <laughs> But the wall spider is just a bit, a bit perturbing. I found nothing comment worthy in that room, so I said nothing. I did nothing, I know nothing! Alright. Yes, they move randomly, quote unquote. I guess technically they don't move randomly. Do you notice that the enemy that's got a like pattern that just bounces around the room, I managed to get hit by like five fucking times. It ought to be a damn Guinness Book World Records record for being so shitty at buying an Isaac. Maybe the game's not as bad and unbalanced as I think. Maybe I'm just bad at it. <laughs> that thought never even entered my head. I was so busy bitching and moaning. Uh, maybe it's I. Who am the worst at Isaac? Well, you know what we can do? That battery's laying there. We can gain kid the boss up. Hey, Gertie, you ain't going nowhere. Keep damaging him. Okay. And he's dead. Try not to get hit by his fucking entourage. Wow, look at all these fucking hearts. What you got for me? Blood Claw. Hey, it's a damage up. Grab this battery to get her game. I, mean, I haven't been in the item room yet. Well, that would be a fucking tragedy to not see what shitty piece of shit. It's very redundant for uh, sentence, but I don't care. Item they're gonna fucking patronizingly throw at me. Okay. How does Northern Lion do it? I, I see now. Why he's so much more popular than I'll ever be on YouTube is because I mean he plays this game. He has like 900 videos of this game up already, and he just goes through all of them. And he never, he never fucking he doesn't do whatever the hell it is I'm doing this episode. <laughs> it's because he's Canadian, isn't it? He gets all hopped up on Canada Dry and flapjacks. And those little chocolate maple leaves that have maple cream in them. And he just goes to town. What is this? What is it? Crack the sky. Holy white death. Booyah. That item can do things, but it usually doesn't. Alright. Well, we Why are we playing as Samson? I think I needed to kill the blue baby. I don't know. The damn character select screen's too fucking cryptic. Alright. I'm planning on recording more Deprived Run after I finish this, so see how that goes. If you listen to the Deprived Run and I'm still fucking whining, then you'll you'll know that I did. You'll know that I fucking went right into it. Where am I at? I think I died in Drang Lake Castle and threw a tantrum and quit playing. That's how I end most sessions of Dark Souls 2. Alright, let's just blow some of these fucking skulls up. Maybe get a tarot card. Or that thing. Why did I come up here? I could see on the map that it was nothing for me here. Well, I'm glad I got this blood clot. I'm not gonna lie. Always nice to have damage. Alright, there's the curse room. AKA that room I'm not going in. Unless I get hit, and I'll probably just go in there anyway. Because why the fuck not? Alright. Stop jumping around the screen and being hard to hit. Okay. Okay. Hit twice, huh? Well, guess what? Curse room or bust. Come on, throw some shit at ya. Have we ever gotten an item out of a curse room? Why do we even bother, kids? If you learn anything from this Izzy video, it's don't bother. You're just gonna die alone. All right. Let's blow up some rocks. Hell yeah. Feel a little better. Feel just a mite bit better. Just a hair. <laughs> I didn't even have the energy to properly complain right then. I just, I sighed to myself. That Judas's tongue, give me that. I think it makes all deal with the uh, devil items cost one heart, I believe. So if, you know, we'll never get a deal with the devil. Well, I mean, unless we find a Joker card. But, uh, let the rosary bead. 
Yeah, you hang on that for me. <laughs> that valuable fucking commodity. Why don't you uh, keep that for yourself there, sweetheart? Alright. I want that key. And I got that key. Hey guys, there's a lot of you and I don't like the placement of you when I walked into the room. Just a little observation. A humorous quip from my old Uncle Tenfe. Alright, what you got for me, lads? Is that the teleporter? My goodness gracious. What will I ever do with myself with such power? Man was not meant to wield such power as the fucking teleporter. Okay. Probably should be using the game kid more. Basically, my only reason I can beat bosses. Oh my god, there's so much in this room to hate. <laughs> but we did it. What's in here? Remote detonator, spirit heart, red heart. You know what we're gonna do? And there we go. And boom goes the dynamite. Which is ironic because I didn't buy the remote detonator. And, oh yeah. High level strats. Evo strats. Justin Wong, I believe I saw him perform that at last year's Isaac Eva. Oh god, it's a double ball string. Two Gertie Juniors, and what do you get? Another day older and deeper and dead. Let's see if I can kill both of them with one game, kid. No, you can't, because he moves slightly too fast. Alright, what we got? Oh shit. Edward Cullen hearing me complaining, so he spawned a devil room. Well, we got Juice's tongue. Be good to us. I took him along and. Is that missing page? I will take both. The Game Kid's been good, but Book of the Law charges faster. That's probably a mistake. The Game Kid was probably carrying us. <laughs> it's the only reason I've gotten to where I am, but fuck it. Let's see, where do we think the boss is? We think the boss is over here. Oh yeah, it's Belial time. Oh my god, why don't you spawn some more shit in the room? I like to think they died because of how mad I was and not, oh hey, we're blah all day, every day, baby. Guess what? It's blah time. There's too much shit going on. How could I be expected to dodge enemies and deal damage in a video game? Where's my hand holding? Alright. Where's my super guide? Why won't Luigi appear and, and offer to beat the level for me? Okay. Guess we gotta go in our shop since we got Pageant Boy on the last floor. It's mandatory. Hey guys, the nun's habit would be a good thing to have when you have the Book of Bilal. You just. I'm crying so much, I just noticed. Ah! Uh, tell you what, we'll leave that be. Maybe we'll find. Hey, I picked right. You motherfuckers. And then there's these assholes. Look at you turning around in the middle of walking across the floor. You cheat son of a bit. Alright. Probably should have used Book of Bilal here and then ran back and grabbed that battery, but I didn't. Here, have a poop bomb. They're so confused by the poop bomb. I can't blame them. If a poop bomb went off near me, I'd probably be, for the first few seconds, I'd be confused. Alright. There, Jesus. Oh, we're at, I forgot we're at Mom. We're, do we're doing too good. I'm doing so good, I didn't even realize that I'm just uh, beating the entire game effortlessly. Is this a special version? Are we just. Is this a vanilla mom fight? I, could, I didn't see the color of her leg. It's just there's a lot of enemies appearing. Ow! Those things are bad for you. I think we're gonna get our boss rush room, which is fucking hilarious. Oh, the game kid would have been so good in here. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna like it. Ah, Book of Law. It pays, you know, over time. It pays for itself. Alright. There, you're dead. Um. I think we wanted the Polaroid on this character. Yeah. Alright, what's the devil got for us? Uh, that. F what, you get fear shots or something like that? That's not really that helpful. What's in our boss rush room? Oh. Yeah, uh, Cricket's body. I guess we'll go with Cricket's body. Let's see if we can survive the boss rush. With all this deeps. Oh! Damn, I should have gone back and 
fucking recharge my book of Allah. I would have made this boss rush considerably easier. <sighs> I hope people don't realize that I'm bad at the game. <laughs> like, maybe you're not really watching and you got the muted in the background and every now and then you look up and you're like, Oh, he's doing the boss rush. He must be pretty good at Isaac. Because otherwise, you might realize that I'm terrible and I blame the game for all my mistakes. Like a true YouTube professional. Okay. Oh, Carrion Queen. How I despise you. Surprised it hasn't laid more annoying red poops around her and that lasts forever. Like smooth jazz. Stop turning around so much. Be easier. <laughs> Stop defending yourself. Alright, I think there was a red heart down here. Yeah, gotcha. Okay. Where are they? Is this something this boss spawns? Huh, I didn't know that. Usually when I do a boss rush, I'm so overpowered that I don't even notice this shit. You're taking a very long time to die. I don't know if you've noticed, but it's aggravating the shit out of me. Alright. Good, 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 good. I think we got this. I think we got this. <laughs> Get what, two of the bosses? Three, I guess, technically now. But still, I think we're good. I think everything will be alright. Every little thing's gonna be alright. I think John Lynn said that once. Okay. Alright, who's next? You, Blastasis. I guess Loki wants to fight first. No? Okay. Not a hard boss. I'm, if you're wondering why I'm not grabbing that spirit heart, it's because usually a lot of red hearts drop during this, so I'm just going to save any spirit hearts that drop for the end. I'm telling you, in the back of my mind, some pro level strats. They're always a brewing. Alright, Loki, where'd you go? Loki, you need to set still and stop bothering Thor. The man's got shit to deal with at Rainbow Bridge. That's all I know about Thor is that Rainbow Bridge. Like, I think he has a hammer. I don't know. Thor is a really boring character, I think. But that's just me. You might be the biggest Thor fan of all time. You might be Thor fan 580. Might be your AOL instant messenger screen name. And if it is, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to offend you. But it's just I don't, I don't care. If I like, like abs and men, I might appreciate Thor more. But I, I don't. So I don't. Thor's a character like... Thor's for moms. Like, kids are like, I want to go see the Avengers. And the mom's like, Jesus fucking Christ, I gotta take this little hell spawn demon to the fucking theater and listen to him run his mouth for 20 minutes and buy him $680 worth of candy. And then she goes in there and she's like, oh my, who's this? Who's this slab of man meat slathered across the screen? Alright, I'm gonna kill these dual monsters. Ah, oh, just dual monstros. Am I doing like a, a champion version of the boss rush? It's Chad! I don't know what his name is a reference to because it's an acronym. Alright. I see there's another spirit heart. So, at the end of this here boss rush, we're gonna have the most spirit hearts. My nose itches. There we go. I was like, how am I going to scratch my nose? I, I need both hands to shoot and stick and move. How am I going to float like a butterfly and sting like a beedrill? There we go. Damn, why didn't I recharge my bucket a while? I need a coach. I need an Isaac coach to set behind me. If I wasn't so tired from illness racking my body... I would do a voice of the Isaac coach as a little character in the background, as I am often wont to do. But I just don't have the fucking energy for it. I'm sorry. <laughs> Thank God this isn't my job, because I would be terrible at it right now today. Oh well. Hopefully you're getting something out of this. Hey, the black page of uh, Chupacabra there. I forgot I had the, the missing page number two or whatever. Well, hey, the more they hit me, the stronger I get. Defeating a sandwich only makes it tastier, son. So, at least I got that going for me. Samson's pretty good in the boss rush room because so many hearts drop that you can just get slobber knocked to hell and going. Damn, I killed him quick. The health meter couldn't even keep up with the deeps I was doing to him, son. 
I went aboard him in the general style of pot. Yeah, this is definitely a champion version. Which means I was fighting a champion version of Mom. Where's all this money coming from? I'm sure I picked up something a hundred fucking years ago. Thank just making all this money drop and I just don't remember it. Okay. I gotta get rid of you. You were just causing me all kinds of strife. Comma cloud. The mask of infamy. Alright, get rid of your heart there. Beans, beans, good for your heart. Are they really? I guess beans are an excellent source of protein. So, I mean, your heart likes protein, right? I guess? I don't know. I'm not a damn nutritionist. Why are you asking me all these questions about the nutritional value of beans? Jesus, I could barely play the fuck Vina Isaac, and now I gotta write up a fucking dietary guide for you? I need this heart. Got it. Alright, man, I'm gonna have a lot of spirit hearts by the time this is done. I am glad Cricket's body was there. Man, I know an item drops after you complete a boss rush. If it's Cricket's head, son, we're gonna be, we're gonna be, you know. Things are finally starting looking up. Everything will be coming up, Samps. Where, oh, where is the boss that you are? Hide behind the rocks, eh? Hiding behind Dwayne the Rock Johnson, eh? It's a good place to hide. How many people are going to fuck with you if you're behind Dwayne Johnson? All he has to do is give you that look. The Rock look. Alright. I have to assume my damage is at Brawly level right now. As many times as I've been hit. I want to get rid of the damn horse that's flying around the room before I go after war. There he is. War, will you calm the fuck down? Guess not. Hey, there's an eternal heart. Lovely. I wish like eight of those had dropped. That might be just enough to get me through this Isaac run. Samson. Samson! Alright, who's next? Oh yeah, that's right. We're on the final phase. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Alright. Where's your body at? Where's your red jewel at? There you are. There we go. There we go. We got this shit on lockdown, baby. This ain't nothing but a thing. Oh, God. Don't die now. We're at the fucking end of the run. <laughs> the end of the boss run. Oh, my God. Get him, fly, that uh, sometimes does damage. <laughs> I think that's the, the item's actual name is fly what sometimes does damage. All right, what we get at the end? Oh, shit. The flush. That's It's such a powerful but limited use item. No, we gotta stick with the Book of Bala. Damn, that's a... Let's see how many hearts we get at the end of this. <laughs> Shit. Alright. What was the Devil Room item again? The Fear Shots? We are gonna get another heart. What do you think? What do you think? Oh, fuck it. Fear shot. I guess fear shot can be useful if you got enemies that get all up in your shit, making them run away from you. All right, where do we? Obviously, the boss is going to be at the end of that fucking hell gauntlet, but I guess we might as well check both sides of this just to, just in case that we are being trolled at a maximum level. How did I avoid taking damage there? I'm so. Oh god, the fear shot is already making the room more tedious. I can't see my HP again. Oh god, I hate brimstone wall spiders. All right, I'm over it. <laughs> I've calmed down, kids. You don't, you didn't see it, but I edited out 30 minutes of me laying in the floor sobbing, and now I've calmed down. God, I wish I knew my HP. I'm gonna die on this floor. I don't know my HP, and it's gonna make me attack enemies with reckless abandon. As if I wouldn't already be doing that. I keep forgetting I have butt bombs, don't I? Am I still on the butt? I've died so many times, I don't even remember if I'm on the butt bomb. Or <sighs> Use the play in Book of Law. Yeah, there we go. Butt bombs will confuse the enemy. And accidentally, the entire secret room. Is this awesome? Alright. Where? Enemies that pop out of the floor. Wow! The Joker card. Paralysis. Lovely. What do you do? 
Tears down. Lovely. Well, let's see what the devil's got for us. Guppy's collar and the nail. And also this chest with a bomb in it, of course. Um, Guppy's collar, I mean, you sometimes don't die. You know, we'll take it. We'll see how our, we'll play with our luck. That leaves me with, I think, one red heart. So that's what we're going with. My shots do look cool. They're black and red. They're black and white and red all over. Like a sunburnt zebra. Alright. I've got keys. I got keys! Are you scared of me, buddy? Because you're dead. Um, at least I know I'm not down to red heart damage yet because I couldn't pick up that fucking red heart. Alright. Then, yeah, the boss room has to be all the way over there. Yeah, it is. And I gotta get through one last gauntlet of these fucking things that nobody likes. Even Edward called it as he programmed it into the game. He had to get up and leave the room because they upset him so bad. Oh, well, we got an easy boss at least. Can't complain about that. I fire fucking... I'm like a Kuma. I shoot dark Hadoukens, whatever. Go Hadouken... I don't know. Kuma's version of all the moves are like edgier. They're like the Shadow of the Hedgehog version. Do we reroll all of our stats? Huh. That could be very risky. What's the devil got to say? Oh yeah, we've already talked to you. Uh, fuck. Yes. Of course we do. Alright. Let's see what our base damage is when we get into the uh, actual next floor. It's at three. Huh. Well, we shoot very fast. All right, where's the boss? Well, we got to check every possible terminus. Okay. So you're not over here. Maybe over here. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I died. Oh, pff, well. Thank you, Guppy's Collar. That's a bad situation in that room in there. I'm not going to lie to you. If the boss is on the other side of that room, I don't know if I'm getting to it. Poops! Damn you, poops. You've always... I've always hated you the most. Not the little poops, though. The little poops are just so happy. God bless their little hearts. Their little poop heart. Okay, blow me up, son. Before you go-go. Okay, okay. I'm liking it so far. So far, so good. Almost, yeah. Good times we're having here right now. Today. Mom's foot hands. They're going to come after me. Hey, we can unlock that room. I hope it's a six. A six dice room. I swear to God, I'm going to step on it if it is. Oh. Uh, okay. Uh hey. -huh. Just loot. Just fat loot, son. What are all the items I have? That's a weird combination of items. Alright, where are we thinking the boss is? All the way over there. It's gotta be. It's gotta be. There's no chance. If it's that little room down there. Oh, God. This is a bad place to be. How have I not gotten hit yet? <laughs> oh. <laughs> I can't kill any of them. All right. Okay. We're good. We're good. Okay. I don't understand how I'm actually clearing this room without dying. Like, I've been sitting here just amazed. I missed horrible. Sorry, my nose itches some more. Okay. Good times was had by all. Hey guys, how you doing? Back at me, you know, here have some poop bomb. I keep. Oh, I thought it would get to him just in time. Hey, I could fear the actual uh, chubs themselves. He still looks so happy as I'm fearing him away from me, though. 
It's a happy fear. It's like when you're scared on your wedding day. You're not really scared, you're just nervous. Because you're going to say something stupid. And your mother-in-law fucking hates you. Oh yeah, I have the Polaroid. I get Polaroid invincibility frames. Thanks for the heart. Peel's here. I don't think I know what that peel does. So let's see how bad it is. But it's pretty it's a pretty fly peel. I don't remember if I know what that peel does either. I have a lot of money, I just realized. I found peels. Uh, of course the boss is at the ass end of the world. I think that's uh the th the last of the Cornetto trilogy from Simon Pegg and Edgar Wright and Nick Frost. The ass end of the earth. Alright. It lives. Okay. I think we can do this. Do you think we can do this? If you do, you're a fool. Because we can't do this. <laughs> There's no way we can do this. But you gotta try, right? Oh god. I feel like some additional... Oh, the blastocyst or cancer to Teratoma. Terranigma. We never got that game. I always wanted to play it. I like Illusion of Gaia. Anyway. Okay, we're in this phase. Gotcha. We're in the circle strafe phase. Oh, you spawned the most asshole of enemies possible. Okay, so... If oh, God. Oh, yeah. Polaroid. I forgot I had that. Okay. Uh, yeah, we're heading to the theater. How? I act like I'm going to get to the blue baby and kill it. <laughs> this run. It's been a very, very odd run. I'm not going to lie. A lot of, lot of unexpected twists and turns on this Isaac run. A la Samson. Abracadabra. My damage is really low. It's making me sad. Making me so sad. Okay, we gotta make the most of this damn Polaroid invincibility to get rid of the damn greeds. Oh, well. Hey, an item appeared in the basement. That was a weird run. I'm so wore out. I'm gonna go lay down. I'm gonna go lay down in a bathtub full of NyQuil and Vicks Vapor Rub. And probably become a Batman villain. Because that sounds like how a Batman villain would be created. 